Hello YouTube, Daniel from Maximum Photoshop's back with another tutorial. Before I get started on the tutorial, I'd like to thank you guys for the 2,000 views that we just hit. Anyway, let's get started with the tutorial. So today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create a really cool looking orb effect, how I did right here. So let's get started. Let's create a new document. I'm just going to do 8.5 by 11 inches with the resolution of 72. Hit OK. First thing we want to do is go to our paint bucket tool and make the background black. Now create a new layer and take your brush tool and you have to decide which color you want your orb or whatever you want to call it to be. I'm going to make mine FF00D2. Now go ahead and click wherever you want and that will be the color of your orb. Here's the next step. Go ahead and make a new layer. Now make sure that your colors are set to foreground white, background black. Go to filter, go to render, and clouds. Now go ahead and click control F a couple times so you like what you see. I like this one because there's an even balance of black and white. So now what we're going to do is we're going to turn off the clouds layer, go to the layer with our orb color, go to the elliptical tool, click on the center of the orb while holding alt and shift, and drag outwards till the orb is finished. Very cool. That should be good. So now go to your clouds layer, right click, and go to layer via copy. Now you can hide the clouds layer for now. Make sure that the cloud layer is centered on your orb color layer. I think that's okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go to filter and we're going to go to liquify. Now what we have to do, we have to select the blow tool and make sure that your brush size is the size of your orb. So now we're going to click a couple times using the settings that I have on the right, which is brush size 460, brush density 97, and brush rate 8. So click a couple times, and that should be good. Click OK, and great. Now what we're going to do is we're going to duplicate the layers a couple times. Now we can delete the cloud layer and hide the layer that you were duplicating. What we're going to do is we're going to go and make our first layer soft light. Very cool. Now you can already see the orb effect setting in. Next, we're going to go to this layer, turn it on, control T, and rotate it a little bit. Very cool. Now we're going to go again, normal, and soft light. Once again, we're going to go to this layer, unhide it, control T. This time I'll turn it the other way. And go again from normal to soft light. And there you have it, guys. You have a floating, really cool orb effect. Simple and awesome. Once again, if you like the video, like, share, subscribe. It really helps me out. I'm going to be out with more. And once again, thank you very much for the 2,000 views. I'll make sure that this PSD is in the description for download. Have a good day. Bye-bye for now.